Well, in other news, the NBA draft taking place last night in New York. Yeah, North Carolina players got drafted last night. And one from right here in the triad. Wesley and Christian alum Aaron Wiggins and WFY News 2's Amanda Ferguson spoke with someone close to him about this exciting time. It's been a dream for Aaron Wiggins to make it to the NBA and something his high school principal has supported. Wiggins has worked extra hard this summer to prove he belongs in the league. He told us ahead of the draft what it would mean to him. That's that's the dream that you really think of growing up. It's, it's the only thought that you have, you know, and it's a dream. That dream has come true for Wesleyan Christian alum and Maryland guard Aaron Wiggins. He was drafted in the second round with the 55th pick by the Oklahoma City Thunder in the 2021 NBA Draft. Aaron Wiggins is beyond basketball. He is one of the finest young men that I've, I've ever known. Wesleyan Christian Academy's principal, Tim Rickman, couldn't say enough good things about Wiggins. He was a great student in school, and, and then he was a basketball player, and a great basketball player on top of that. So he is one of those special students, and, and I was thrilled when I got the word that he was, that he was drafted last night. Wiggins is not only a part of the NBA now, but he's joining a roster with a fellow Trojan on it, Jalen Horde. It's exciting to have those two together, and uh, it, it's just it's just a, an honor for Wesleyan. And, and I'll tell you what's an honor about them. They're great young men. They are not just basketball players. And they are young men who will, will make a wonderful way in life, even when basketball is over with. And because of that, that makes me as their high school principal even more thrilled. Now there are four Wesleyan Christian players in the NBA. The other two are Theo Pinson and Harry Giles. Go Heels, Theo Pinson. <laughs> That's very cool. And you can tell how proud yes. the principal was um, of his former student. Yeah, he and was we smiling were, so big. Yeah, we were talking about what this means for the school, but also for other kids in the triad that this shows that if you put in the work, you can really get to where you want to go and your dreams coming true. And Aaron's a perfect fit for the Oklahoma City Thunder. They're missing a, a shooter. They could use another wing that's a great defender. So you could plug him right in there. He, great three-point shot, great defender. And how cool is that? Four kids from the same high school from the triad in, in the NBA. They're certainly inspiring lots of kids here in the triad, and I'm excited to see where they go. Yeah. We'll have to watch them. Amanda, you'll have to bring us the highlights. Yes. We will, especially <laughs> since two of them are on the same That's team. That's crazy. That's awesome. you, right? Very cool. <laughs> I wonder if they'll get back into the old pattern that they had when they were playing up the road in High Point. That would be very cool. <laughs> and it's pretty nice probably when you go to a new state, a new city, and have someone you know. Yeah, maybe fun. we can get an exhibition game out this way, maybe. <laughs> That'd be fun. All right. I'd like that.